Now today, my MT-09 celebrates officially his fourth birthday. It's today that I've owned this bike for four years, and I have enjoyed every ride of every day in a winter to summer to spring. Group rides, alone rides, every part of it. I've enjoyed modifying it, upgrading it, doing things to customize it, making parts for it. But the biggest thing I enjoy more than anything else at this point in my life is just going out to the garage, pre-flighting a bike, and going for a ride. This bike is so much fun to ride, always. So today when I got the weather, they said it was 50% chance of rain before lunch, and thunder showers by one. Well, oh, that's no problem for me. I like to get up early in the morning, and it's been so hot, I don't even care if I get wet in the middle of this ride. Oh, it's always amazing to me how quick time goes by. And as you get older, time goes seems to go faster anyway. Four years ago, Luciano and I went down to in the New Brunswick area, picked up this bike, and I had no idea if I was going to like it, not like it. I already had planned some styling changes. <clears throat> I had no idea how it was going to fit into my enjoyment of riding, if it was going to be comfortable. And I had a lot of questions in my mind. And to be honest, I wasn't sure I made the right choice. I had narrowed it down to two or three. And in the end, I think I made the right choice. And I made the right choice getting the farm work done this morning because I wanted to get out on the open road. If once the fish are fed, once the garden is taken care of, once I pick some fresh flowers for Karen, and this time of year, I like to have all the work done. It's a birthday party day. A birthday party for the MT-09. Even the butterflies are, they're happy to uh, celebrate with us. But it's funny how four years just seems to come and go. And I look around at other things and I say, geez, I've owned both of my cars 15 years already. They're both 15 years old. <laughs> a lot of the bikes in my collection are getting older by the day. And the pond is 30 years old now. And when Craig and I dug the pond, Everything has an age that I attach it to. We've been farming over 30 years. I call it a farm. It's really a garden. And Karen's enjoyed that. And we always enjoy, this is the last of the cabbages. The last of the cabbages. And this is the first year we grew cabbage. And she made some soup out of it. And she made, uh, oh my God, a couple of things. I, I really enjoyed it. And this is the last one. And from this point in the year on, we want cabbage. Can you imagine this? We're going to have to buy it in the store. So for a birthday party, what is appropriate? Well, I figured fill up the fuel tank. Even though the roads are still wet, they're predicting rain. We had big rain go through the other day. I'm always willing to take a chance. And this time of year, it's so hot anyway. Even when you get wet, it doesn't even matter. Just a pain cleaning the bike. And for his birthday, I'm going to look to try to get a couple of really fun hours. And be very careful. We don't do anything silly. And I always say, this bike, doing something silly, this bike will make you do something silly. It makes you into a hooligan, makes you think you're a bad guy or whatever. I don't know. I don't know what it does, but it does it. And it does it not only to me, but to everybody I know that has one. Same feeling. Sometime I catch myself whistling that song, I fought the law and the law won. Only I fought the law and the valentine won. I don't know, maybe we both won. I don't know. Now because we've been riding this bike a lot, I've been trying to monitor the wear on the Michelin 6s. And so far it looks like they're wearing pretty good, but I, def I haven't done any of the tallies. But we're going to have that for sure before the end of the year. Now, people that 
don't ride as often as I do, and maybe they only ride once or twice a week, they wear out a lot less parts, a lot less chains and tires and, oh my God, just everything. And oil changes and filters, of course. Just, you ride a lot and things wear out. Now, because it had rained the night before, you can see the roads are where we're in the shade. The roads are still wet. And as soon as you get out into the sun, great traction. You can get on the gas anytime you want. And when the roads are like this, you can feel that traction control kick in every once in a while. And, of course, it's, it's a comforting feeling to know, along with the ABS, the safety features on the bike. In the beginning, I wasn't crazy about them. I've come to like them. And, in fact, I've come to love them. And every time I do ride the bike, I look back and I think about the two years in the beginning when I was changing things around, I added things, made carbon fiber parts, painted the wheels, polished the exhaust. The list goes on and on. And the final thing we did not long ago to seat Cal. And I think all of those modifications are somewhere on the channel. We have over 3,100 videos now. And I've gotten so much good feedback recently. So much. And I want, without even forgetting to do it, I want to thank everybody that sends in very nice, pleasant comments. But the real reason, and it's hard to skirt around it, the real reason I like to have a collection of bikes, every one is a little bit different, every one is a unique experience, and I, lo I love them all, I'll be honest, and I just like the idea when I wake up in the morning, it's like uh, you get to pick one, and who's going to pitch, and who's going to catch, and who's going to play first base, and sometimes when you're going to hang out with your friends, go on a group ride, go on a ride like today where uh, we're just celebrating a birthday party. Every one of the rides, every one, every single one is a lot of fun. And I think about the bikes I've had in my collection. I have one bike I've had uh, 42 years already. I, I'm not sure because I'm going to be 79 soon, I'm not really sure I'm going to own this bike for 40, 42 years. And every day that I get to ride, I think, how important it is for me especially to get that exercise. That exercise is such a big part of my life right now. And getting it every day in a way that's enjoyable, and this bike makes it fun. And it's hard to imagine a better way to stay in shape than have a bike you enjoy riding and some nice roads. This part of the country is wonderful. And... It gives you a nice workout, and you get to have fun doing it. And of course, the four years have gone by very pleasantly. I, and again, I say it over and over again, I'm always amazed how fast time goes by, and it seems to go faster and faster as you get older. But this bike has really helped keep me young, keep me fit, keep me mentally alert. Give me something to wake up for in the morning that I'm really passionate about and excited about and want to do. And I, I'm sure that all, in the end, at the end, all that exercise pays off. But now it's time to get back to the farm and the cabbage. So this really was a wonderful way to celebrate the four years with the MT-09, and we officially have had it. Starting tomorrow, we're going to be on our fifth year, and that is, to me, just amazing how much fun I've had. But it's time to see what Karen's doing. Notice those cabbages are missing. We had cabbages earlier in the year. They're all, we have two actually, and 
Karen is going to surprise me and make me something. And I said, well, you make something. I thought she'd make a cabbage birthday cake or something. <laughs> she made some great cabbage, great cabbage soup. And I got to go see what she's doing. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the video. Please hit the like button if you did, and thank you so much for watching.